The abandoned tanker is now drifting 30 miles out at sea, her cargo of phosphoric acid leaking from her ruptured tanks. The ship is listing badly. Experts from the French Maritime Service are expected to be put aboard soon to work out if she can be salvaged and towed to safety. It was shortly before 3 o'clock this morning that the crew of the East was taken off the stricken ship. Half the 22 men on board were winched to safety by two rescue helicopters from the south of England. The rest clambered aboard a lifeboat from the Channel Islands. The collision happened about 30 miles northeast of Guernsey. The other ship involved, a Polish cargo vessel, was not damaged. The seamen, mostly from the Philippines, were taken to Guernsey and treated for hypothermia and shock. None suffered any serious injury. I was uh, lying in my bed uh, early morning and uh, it suddenly got a big collision and I thought it was uh, uh, the, the, the ship uh, was uh, ground. It's still not known what caused the collision and although our cargo holds are leaking badly, experts from the Coast Guard Agency say the chemical the East was carrying will dissolve in the water and does not pose a pollution threat.